Now at six, new video just into the newsroom from the scene of a deadly hit and run Monday night near the Marquette Interchange. Bailey Halio was killed as she was walking on the highway. Good evening. My name is Shannon Sims. And I'm Charles Benson. Witnesses tell police she was dancing in traffic before she was hit. Michelle Fiore talked to the family today. She's also been looking through this new video. Michelle. Charles and Shannon, it's a two hour video. We scrolled through it. So have sheriff's deputies as they try to figure out how and why a pedestrian wound up four stories high walking along the Marquette interchange. Putting together the pieces, the precious clues this DOT video and witness accounts have given investigators. I think it was a male. I, I, I barely saw him before I, I swerved to not hit him. The video shows the aftermath, squad cars on the scene. Deputies tell us they also have video of the victim walking down a ramp before she was hit. So I don't know if he was about to jump in another car. I just passed him. It was like, just went too fast. Okay, we have someone on the way out there. Bailey Hallio was hit on I-43 near 10th and Michigan by an SUV that left the scene. The driver later returned. Charges are now being considered. Witnesses stopped to help out. You're, you're there with her? Is she awake? Is she awake? She's like barely, barely even breathing. To know Hallio wasn't alone in her final moments is a comfort to her family. It's just grateful to hear that people were with her trying to help her and assist her in any way that they could possible making sure that she just wasn't left alone. Family spent the day planning a funeral for a young woman gone too soon. She was a great person and a wonderful person who would be missed. Missing a young woman with a kind heart and a talent for drawing. This was Hallio's passion. A witness had thought Hallio looked like she was dancing in the lanes, but her family doesn't believe it. They think something went terribly wrong. Live in the newsroom, Michelle Fiore, today's TMJ4. All right, Michelle, thank you.